today we're gonna make a nice container with a lid out of wood. For this project, what you wanna do is choose a straight grain piece of wood. The length and diameter do not matter. It's more understanding the technique to make these containers. So what I did was after I picked out my length of wood, I went ahead and cut about two inches free. And this is going to come later on as our top. Now what we're gonna do is we are going to take this piece of wood that I have here, and we're gonna baton this into four pieces. So I'm going to come to the top and we're going to baton it this way and then baton it that way. Okay, the next step now is to put a cut into this triangle of wood. So we don't want to cut too deep into this. We want to just stay on the top and cut about two thirds of this triangle away. So it takes a little bit of getting started here because you're cutting at a strange angle at first. But once you get it going, just take your time, stay even, and work your cut down into your wood. Now that all my cuts are in place, I'm going to remove this center section. So it's a good rule of thumb as you go down here, just feel where it's at. If it doesn't feel like it's gonna split out, take your saw back out and cut it free just a little bit more. And that quick, it came out. This is what we're looking for in all of our pieces. All right, now we have each and every section cut. So simply, start to reassemble all of these pieces. Now, what we have is a nice container. You can go back in and trim this up on the inside with your knife if you would like to, but this is gonna work out quite well how it is. So you can see that the bottom is gonna close back in really nicely, and now we have something that we can store material in. Now there are a ton of different ways that we can go about putting this together. What I'm going to do is utilize just a straight lash on this. So I'm gonna put a straight lash on the top and on the bottom of this container. And at this point now we have ourselves a nice container. So it is still squared off, of course, like I said earlier, you can go in here with your knife before you assemble this and carve this more to a round shape if you would like. You can also take this at this point now and either wax the inside or wax the outside for a more tight seal. So now of course we can take our top and we can make a lid for this if we would want to. If we're gonna do that, um, very simple process of how we're gonna do that. What we're gonna do is we're gonna just cut a square shape in here with our saw. So now we have our square center cut free to fit on the inside. I'm gonna use my saw because it's gonna be a little bit more efficient. So I hope you enjoyed this video, different techniques, something that you can try out in the woods. It gives you some skills with your knife, some skills with your saw, and material selection. And then you end up with a pretty nice container that you can keep some of your outdoor items in that you either create or gather along the way. So this was Dan Wolwak of Coldcracker Bushcraft. Check us out at coldcrackerbushcraft.com. Until next video, stay in the woods.